Okay, so let me get this straight. Black Jimmy and the secret founder, that's you. That's you, little rap guy. You're the secret founder of, of the black people. <laughs> I mean, we're seven, ten, we're seven tenths, the high-ranking generals. And we would know if you were if you were in the black pupils, little rap. You stop playing with us. Anyway, if you were really the, if you were really the guy, if you were really the secret founder with the, with Black Jimmy and the secret founder story, you would know. You would know the story. That's what that's what I'm trying to tell you. That's not even that's not the real story. And and we we that the story that is told, that's even a different Black Jimmy. That we, we named him that specifically for down the road. If they try to figure out who Black Jimmy is, they'll never figure out. That's a guy from the Bronx, but the, the real Black Jimmy's from Hartford. Oh my God, man. You just say that because you don't even know the real Jimmy, the, the real Black Jimmy story. You're not just the pot, even, you just probably even don't even know the popular version in full. When you get to be a fifth, a fifth, a fifth tenth general of the black pupils, they tell you the story about how black Jimmy and about how a young person and they figured out a way to use correlation and to use English grammar in, in the predicate act about, in other words, the value of the predicate act and the value of correlation nature as the value of English, its nature, its value of its nature, its identity of value, which is also an identity of relationship to itself, which is value, increasingly. And this is the secret story, because the predicate act is about organized crime, but it's a, the black pupils are a counter to that organized crime that was left entrenched here, entrenched here where our founders didn't have free speech. They were also forced to sensibilities in the speech tactical interior than they wanted to be to even in letters even with roles with the counters because even that was forced to unfold where no one understood where everyone did it but they all knew they were going to be in, in trouble if they didn't force themselves into a forced nave fake side modern nation role suit and ties counters that owned the don't understand too oh my god I don't understand what you just said, but that's true. It is about the predicate act and, and about the organized crime and the founding. Little rap guy. So you're saying, you're saying that Black Jimmy is not really from the Bronx, and then that, that he's really from, from Hartford, Hartford, Connecticut, and Weathersfield, Connecticut, the neighboring suburbs and cities of. Of Hartford are where George Washington had to come right before the last battle of the Revolutionary War. But he could only send me a counter extort, even with the French general's help, could only send me a counter extort. Everyone forced into roles to fight to be a new nation. Not of a not a constitutional unabridged nation, still criminally foreign influenced from the entrenched method, everyone still having to hide the roles sticking up the surface of the Constitution and leaving all criminally foreign influenced states and areas, even though it was called colonies. Oh, come on, little states rap States and guy. areas. That, that the part identity about the of predicate ground. act, about the organized crime is true. But, 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 and we have all this extortion, counter extortion you play in these games. If it was true about George Washington, we'd all know this. <laughs> yeah, I know me. The black pupils is not about George Washington in American history. The reason we founded the Black Pupils was to be was to counter the same organized crime that was left for our founders to to counter. But we have to use correlation natures, simultaneously inherent, active, and progressive means to demonstrate this. Wait, tell us, tell us you about the, um, the 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 real Black Jimmy then. Uh, tell the, this is crazy. Now I was a kid from the suburbs who started boxing in about the mid '90s in Hartford, Connecticut, when I met Black Jimmy as one of the people, you know, I mean, uh, you meet all kinds of people. And it's important to understand how Hartford, Connecticut is between New York and Boston as the capital of Connecticut, where George Washington left 
overt slavery entrenched right before the last battle of the Revolutionary War, even with the French general's help. To, to, to correlation, the, 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 you know, he didn't want to do that. He was forced to that, and we're supposed to be able to demonstrate that. And who would argue other? Can you hear it's me? recorded. Can you stop extrapolating on all the points tied to the story and just stay on the, on, the, on the real Black Jimmy then? Okay, so Black Jimmy was a typical higher than uh, middle-aged, you know, forsaken, devalued, identity theft, Black American male. You know, and you know the reactions to that are things that, like, when you have interactions, you know, when, when we talk about things in life, in other words, I, I met him the regular ways, talking about things, and you know, and how you deal with, with with values like black and white. And you know, everyone agrees that oh, yeah, it's nuts. So how did Black Jimmy transition from just being a, 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 a guy in a gym talking to a white guy, a young white a boxer, to, to be in an organized crime role with him? Every once in a while, I would try to explain in life to everybody something about correlation. No, in other words, if you have still entrenched criminally foreign influence states and areas, even though there were colonies, whatever. When they, even Jim Crow laws, treatments of, of the organized crime that was involved with um, the Civil War, it involved with the, with the interpretation of the value of each of, of like uh, President Lincoln. This is, in other words, and this is where everyone would say, oh, you know. But one day, he, one day, I said something, and it registered in the mind of Black Jimmy. Understood what I was trying to talk about first, about black pupils, and the whites of eyes, and what's clear, and how you could tell when courts are lying, and how if we really had free speech and, and no identity thefts and stuff like that, and we'd be able to demonstrate states and areas criminally foreign influenced, but they're stealing our identities and free speech. And, and and then we started talking about the Predicate Act, and then and, and, I, and I was teaching um, Black Jimmy about how the the, the science is sharing identity, which is which no one's taught because they have each of the sciences wrought with physical delusions, criminal foreign influences that our fathers left us to demonstrate. Otherwise, everyone would know this that we need a quality of fact Jimmy nature let demonstrated when we have states and areas interbranch collusion, forging names, switching names, with physical delusions, intersciences, crime methods that are bonded, fact natured liars, styles of liars, motivations for liars. That would, that's what left branches of states and areas criminally foreign influence, but not sourced by one, specifically to keep hundreds of nations for shared as nays. Suits and ties and counters that don't understand. Victim, predator, fact cheat in nature values through campuses, criminally foreign influence from off campuses, and then on off it constantly in conjunction with this. A crime method against correlation nature trinity. He <laughs> mean, but basically, I showed, I proved to, 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 to Black Jimmy that we could, I could prove that each of the branches were lying. And, I, and, and we set a plan so we could get every each age of fact cheap nature at the same time, a whole bunch of little kids and stuff like to catch them lying. And we did that. Well, that's what the that's what the hundred gangs was about. But we did it legally. But what they did, that's when we found out how they were offensive, using offensive evidence fabrication rackets, identity theft rackets. Not just the overt, like with color, but these are bonded identity theft crimes in, in the streams of courts each day, in prisons each day. What do you think? In, through campuses each day. Everyone's being attached to fake relationships, conversations, fake sequences, ties to others. 
For each age of fact treatment nature raised, each position of fact treatment nature raised criminally foreign influence specifically for them to need to hide lie progressions. Russia, American fake sides, psychology crime roles against Russians, Russians against Russians, Americans against missions, recorded the crime method of them fighting needed to keep already valued inter, inter branch here, there, Area of lie progressions, lie progression nature, cover-up styles, criminal uses of titles, of identities of titles. 